Hello everyone and welcome back to Pikmin. Last time, uh, we explored the forest navel. Got two parts with the biggest luck I've ever had in my life. This time, I've mauled over where we want, I've mauled over where I want to go for probably for a bit too long. It's been like two weeks since I last recorded. Um, there are plenty of things we can do in the Forest Naval. And there are the last two parts in the Forest of Hope. Uh, there's also, we can get the part at the impact site, but there's something else there a little bit later that I want to go over. So we're going to skip that for now. To start, we're going to go back to the Forest Naval. Uh, we saw one part that should be relatively easy to get. Keyword should. Uh, the bread bug is gone. We don't have to deal with that. Okay. Okay. I just want to check. So this... Uh... We need to get rid of those enemies and this wall. So I'm going to need yellows. Let's get 10 because I'm pretty sure there's 10 bombs down there. And the wall is going to need 9, so we'll just use the spare for, for something. Uh, the bombs. Get out of there. Uh, where were the bombs? They're down there. God, why do they lock on like that? Ah, uh, that blue five is actually back. Uh, so I, I didn't show this last time. Uh, this is a thing. The Pikmin build it up. And then they can just go up, and then they can climb up there. Once it's done, I'm going to call them all. I don't know if Bomb Pikmin can climb that. <coughs> So I'm going to throw them anyway. But, like, this is a thing. And once they're done, uh, if you leave them to their own devices, they will climb it. Uh... Pluck that bomb out of the ground. I think that's an infinite spa bomb spawner. Uh. Okay. Nope. Nope. They can climb that just fine. Uh. So. They'll be there. They'll be okay. I need to go back to base first. I'm going to take out 50 reds. for a very special reason that you'll see in a moment. Uh, did, who tripped? I dismiss them here. There's no stick to get all the way up there, so... You gotta throw them the rest of the way. Uh, the reds are far enough. Shit. He lived. <laughs> this is a weird camera. It's on a slope. Sorry, sorry, this is going to take me a moment. This is kind of a weird camera angle, and I want to be careful. Yeah, this is, a, this is a thick wall, taking nine bomb rocks to deal with. Probably why that's an infinite spawner, because there's also just that many stone walls near base. Uh, I'm going to leave these Pikmin. 
not quite in base. I'm gonna go use this last bomb bomb rock on that wall. I don't know if that was one away or not. Nope. Needs one more. But I'm gonna leave these boys in base. Oh, I am wasting time, aren't I? Actually, I'm, yeah, I, I won't leave them in base. I will let them do this. Well, I call these boys to deal with the, these motherfuckers. <coughs> ah, man. Some of them lost their, their leaves. Let's just deal with these two. These two are the main threat. Whoa! Jesus fucking needed them. Yeah, these, these boys can throw Pikmin, which can lower them from flower down to bud, or even straight to leaf, I think, in some scenarios. Now, these boys are a little dangerous. <laughs> Because water. <laughs> There's water around here. We didn't lose any. Cool. We're gonna take all these things back for Pikmin. I probably should have given all this to, like, blues. Shit. Shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Ah, it's this time. Shit, fuck him up. So, this boy is a real big pain in the ass. Uh, I lost two. Where are the rest of them? Oh, they're carrying shit back. Uh, yeah, let, let's just have them all carry, carry. Let, let's just carry all the shit back. Uh, those were sheer wigs. Their enemy bio should have been up already. So, sheer wigs are basically flying versions of the male sheer grub. They can still just pretty much insta kill a Pikmin. So. Be a little. Why are they taking this path? I, mm, I, oh, I literally opened that up for a reason. Uh, as you'll soon come to realize, Pikmin are stupid. Pikmin are just really stupid. Okay. Case in point. Okay. I'm thinking this might be the only part we get today. Okay. Whoa, that's a lot. We're gonna leave them planted for about as long as possible. Okay, let's get them on that. Uh, And now I've got a ton of, like, leaves and shit. Okay. While they're getting that back, they will hopefully not be attacked. I'm gonna spend some time and pluck all these. I probably should have pulled Pikmin out before doing this, but whatever. <laughs> no. So we're gonna take all these reds and go deal with things. Maybe get another part. Uh... Shit, I actually don't. Fuck, what can't? What else can I do today? I know this area is pretty open at this point, so that's right there. There's that. There's that. Uh, fucking either of those, frankly. Uh, I. Sure, let's get this. 
Uh, where are they with that part? Oh, they're right there. Okay. I found the automatic gear. This thing chugs right along its own pace. It makes piloting much easier, giving me time to concentrate on the finer points of space travel. Let's speed that up. Guess that has a max 25. Yeah, the parts also have like a, ma a max Pikmin thing. I'm not going to be putting that on screen. Because I don't see that as terribly necessary. Automatic gear. It has thin cracks running through it. I tried to fill them with dirt. I hope it will be alright. Oh no. Alamar's ship is going to explode again. Okay. So I'm going to put the yellows away for now. I don't think we're going to get much else done with them. Alright, and I'm going to put away a fair amount of my reds. I'm going to have 50. Let them all go in. Okay. Oh, I only have 30 blues. I hope that's enough. <laughs> So we're gonna go get, we're gonna try to go, God, this map. Uh, we're gonna try to go get that there at the end of that path, at, at the end of that long tunnel that's in the water. Oh shit, is that a bomb wall? Oh, one way to find out. Um, honestly, using a day to just scout ahead and try to, and trying to plan is not a bad use of a day. Oh shit! Uh, it's not a good setup. Uh, Cause he's okay. It, it's just this kind of wall. Okay, swarm him. Whoa. almost dead. Okay. Yep. Uh, the only way... That's a fiery blowhug, by the way. I think I said that. I don't know. Yeah, the, the only way oh, they those can hurt a red Pikmin is if they throw it in the water, as one did earlier. Come on. I saw you trip. Hurry up. So we got a big, big damage wall here. That's going to take a little bit of time, so I'm just going to scout around. <laughs> this. Oh, shit. That's a Wallywog. I won't put his bio up yet. Granted, I said that about something else. Uh, there's another part. We need a lot of blues for that. So we're going to have to go blue grinding at some point. We are not getting this part today, huh? Uh, well, if this wall goes down, we can just gun it tomorrow. Uh, I can spend like the first half of the day raising blues to get that other part. So I'm, I'm kind of okay with, un with no parts today because I'm semi-confident that we can get two tomorrow. Essentially, we just need to try to keep a one a day average. Oh, well, we're sh stretching there. We, we want. Uh, <laughs> sliding. Uh, we want to try to keep a one a day average. These are fire geysers. Red Pikmin are immune to it. The blues that we need are not. Shit. Shit. Okay. We're, we're fine. Dismiss. And this is pretty small, so I don't think 30 is too few. On my analog computer, this computer conveys the kind of vague data that falls outside the range of ones and zeros. Actually, to be honest, a little bit too vague, so it isn't very helpful. Takes 20. Let's get all 30. Okay. 
Will they go up or will they go down this path? They are going down that path. Okay. In that scenario. Ooh. Uh, iridescent flint beetle. New thing. Shit. Eh. Uh, you, you hit it, it gives uh, pellets and nectar. And it'll shit. Okay, uh, we are not getting this thing back today, but it is out of the water. So I'm I'm okay with no stop that. Uh, there's, there's a red uh, candy pop bud here. If you put yellow, uh, I think it's five or ten yellow or blue Pikmin in there, it will turn them into red sprouts, uh, which can be useful. Uh, this was kind of a wasted day, but. We got that part out of the water so I can just gun it with reds once uh, the day starts. And then I can uh, spend the rest of the time raising blues. So, good, we're good there. Spend some time raising blues. Get, try to get that other part. <clears throat> Pikmin always carry their prey back to the onions. Close observation indicates that taking food pellets to onions of the same color results in the release of larger numbers of Pikmin seeds. I've also found ways to group Pikmin by color. I can hold A to grab one, press B to swap it out. Press A to grab one for a moment, or press C to dismiss them into like colored groups. Very useful. I lost two. What did I lose two of? Oh, reds. The fucking sheer grubs. Okay, so we're gonna go, so we got one part that day, and we're set up pretty well to get two, now that I know that I've scouted the area a bit, and know what I'm doing. I, I, I didn't really look too much into things before starting this, I probably should have, but that would have been boring. It's funnier when horrible things happen. <laughs> uh, I think the max uh, Pikmin that can be on that part was 30, so I'm going to take 30. We're going to go deal with it. Uh, yeah, that already reverted back, so if you didn't get the part, but you built the stick, you'd have to rebuild the stick. Uh, oh shit, I'm gonna have to babysit this, aren't I? That sucks. Uh, I could also spend some time building that with... I forgot how much fucking damage that did. Okay, they're all on that. Uh, I don't want to have to... Hell is that down there? I wish I had like free camera control rain. Uh, I definitely want to get that five pellet for the blues. But like also, I'm gonna have to babysit this thing because it gets kind of close to water. I think it'll be fine even if they don't like super hug the wall, but I need to keep an eye out on this. But yeah. So, there's another ship part right there. We have to go through some Wallywogs to get it. Ah, uh, they're hugging the wall pretty good. Please just go up through there and not the stupid long path. Where are they going? Where are you going? <sighs> the Pikmin are kind of stupid sometimes. Please come up here, thank you. 
Okay. And with knowing that they're fine, let's get all our blues out. Hurry up. Computer. This strengthens the outward emotions of the dolphin's computer. Well, it does make the computer smart. It also makes it quick to anger. It's just like my boss. Eleven out of thirty. One more should be able to increase my ship's capabilities. So we're doing pretty good. Uh, having eleven on day eight is, all things considered, pretty decent. Pretty decent. Uh, more would would be nice, but whatever. Uh, are these about to sprout? Because that would be lovely. Uh, I also need more bombs to do things. I will dismiss these boys. And I will pull out ten yellows again. Let's get the bomb squad going. Because apparently, yeah, there's just infinite bombs here. I don't know if this is on purpose, if this is a glitch, because they're definitely just pulling bombs out of the floor. I forgot to build the stick. Whoops. Wait a second. A couple of you don't have bombs. Now you're all bombs. <sighs> Certainly not fast, but whatever. I'm not too terribly worried about quickness. <laughs> Maybe that's not the kind of attitude to have in a game like this, where quickness kind of means everything. <laughs> Like literally, if you do not beat the game fast enough, you get a you get the bad ending. <laughs> uh, I think that one wall is a single bomb away, and the other one is a nine bomb wall. Oh, yep, those all popped up, so I can do that in a moment. Ah, oh, that's oh my god! There's so many walls. I know you can get two Pikmin to drop bombs. My pointer is being not, it's not having fun. I'm being careful because I don't want to kill my Pikmin. deal with that. That should be that wall down. Cool. And I know it's only ten of you, but y'all work on that. Uh, okay, how do I want to divvy up this labor? So we got thirty. Uh, this will make for thirty-five. I'm here for a moment. I'm gonna grab my 30 reds and I'm gonna shove them on this too so that will go a little bit faster. Uh, here's a little short path back to base for Olimar, but the big one can't really get up. But yeah, there's a stick. So. Playing a risky game here doing this, but. Okay. 
Wallywogs are aggravating. They jump, and when they land, they crush any Pikmin underneath. Like that. <laughs> Uh, for the most part, any Pikmin on top of them are fine. It's just knowing when to stop throwing. Okay, come on. A a attack so I can... just lost. I lost one. Wallowogs are a pain to fight, mainly because they take forever. But, oh, you son of a bitch. You knocked them over. Oh, God, I'm not gonna have enough for this, am I? I seem to have kind of locked him in place at the very least. Shit. These guys suck to fight, especially because they're always in water. You can't even get the damn it, the extra damage from reds. Oh, you! I hate. Cool. We're now dealing with two. <sighs> Fucking god! All right, you come on, jump already. So you can be away from your fucking friend over there. Ugh. This is a bad situation <laughs> to be in. Fucking... I'm giving all of this to the blues. Useless, all of you. <sighs> to anyone who's played Pikmin, these things are the fucking bane of your existence. Go back to where you were so I can move the five pellet. I'll I'm gonna have to babysit these guys, aren't I? Uh. There's that one. There's the fucking blowhogs. This is just an all-round kind of aggravating area. This is always a blue. Here, fucking take it. You do take that back to base. What are they doing? What are they doing? I hate Pikmin. Pikmin are so fucking stupid. Pikmin are so genuinely stupid. They're taking the longest fucking route to base. <sighs> Why? I should have left those walls unbombed. Oh my fucking god, you morons. <laughs> We're not getting that second part today. <laughs> That's for damn sure. I'd like to at least deal with the Wallywogs. Or the other Wallywog. I... I'm angry. <laughs> I'm angry at this stupid fucking game. We had, we had 35. We lost 10 to one Wallywog. So aggravating. With what it sprouted, we we still lost two. 
Okay, well, let's, let's, I guess, go attempt to fight the other one. And maybe see what what's needed for that part. Also, that blue five pellet. Is he stuck? Is he stuck on the part? No, he's not. Get over here. He's going back to his initial position. Now, once you get the timing down for how many Pikmin you can throw, game does become a lot easier. Yo. I, I hate these guys so much. They're such an ass. They are probably the most annoying, like, single enemy to fight that isn't classified as a boss. Like, genuinely, they're that aggravating. And what's worse, like, they, they, they get worse. <sighs> ah, fuck, really? Uh, I want him dead. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. <sighs> get in the party. Got one part today. We have a semi-decent setup for a second. <sighs> Why did they take such a long path? There was a direct route to base. <sighs> Never underestimate how stupid Pikmin are. They will always surprise you with how fucking stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> I need to see how many we lost in battle. It, it's probably... I know of at least 10. Maybe a couple more. To like a fucking fiery blowhog. Oh. Ah. The Pikmin can choose their own routes. Yep. And they choose the dumbest one every fucking time. They will go straight through, straight through enemies. They don't fucking care. But, does this indicate rational thought or just basic instinct? Certainly not rational thought. I cannot determine that at this point. I will be vigilant in my studies, though. Ten to the Wallywog. Ah. <laughs> we gained three. We gained three blue Pikmin at the end of that. Uh, the other ten we sprouted. Yeah, we only sprouted blues, and we only lost blues. Ugh. God. The game only gets harder from here, too. Okay. Well, next time on Pikmin, we go back into the Forest Naval to try to get that part from the Wallywogs. And hopefully something else. See you guys then.